Listen, for the inexperienced drivers, right? I want you guys to, you know, to listen, okay? And again, this is just my opinion, but I really feel that Snyder has a good, solid foundation in trucking, especially in their school division, all right? Especially in their school division. When you go to their orientation, they will make you one of the best, if not, if not close to it, all right? Maybe best is just overplaying it, but they'll probably make you, give you close to being a good driver as you could possibly can be. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. I've been watching you. You have? You ain't watched behind your ears or nothing. But I did. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So as always, the Recruiter Call channel, always get questions that's always been asked and answered in many, many, many episodes. And you guys want to know what that pivotal question is, right? Well, here I am to tell you because I, I get it in Facebook groups. I get it in DMs. I get it in emails. And this question particularly comes from new drivers, drivers that are getting into the industry, drivers that are finishing up their schooling, graduating, drivers that, you know, that don't know nothing about the industry, but they're interested in the industry. Those drivers. Now, experienced drivers already know the answer to this question. And they have or they have answered this question plenty of times. Now, I'm not here to say that I'm an I mean, I'm a veteran or anything like that, but I've been in the game long enough to know the answer to this question. Now, a lot of you guys like to ask me this question. And y'all want to know what that question is? Well, I, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. I'm about to tell you right now. Excuse me. I happen to be passing. I thought you might like some coffee. Oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you. So the drivers, people, inexperienced, they come, they ask this question. They say, hey, lockout. What is the best company out there? Y'all see that? Y'all see that right there? They always ask that. What is, the, what is the best company out there? Well, let me tell you. There's thousands upon thousands upon thousands of trucking companies that's out here that's looking for drivers. Whether you're new or a veteran, there's companies out here that's looking for drivers. Again, whether they're good or bad whether they're the best place to work for or the worst place to work for. You will never know. You will never know what company is the best company. You will never, ever know that. But let me talk to you inexperienced drivers, the drivers that's coming straight out of school. Let me, let me hold back and talk to you for a minute, all right? Because here's my thought, all right? I do my research. I, I made plenty of calls over the years. I talked to plenty of drivers. And I came to the conclusion that there are a few companies out here that you could start off with that would get you on the right path. Right? Right? Now, this is just my opinion. So, you know, take it full, full what you want with it. All right? But if you want, when you come out here, you get in a truck and you want the company to teach you to be the best driver that you can be going into the future, I'm going to have to go with Snyder. What? Oh, wait. Snyder? 
I always said throughout the years, and if you go back and listen to any of my podcasts that, you know, that when people ask me about driver training and everything, I always said that Snyder was the boot camp of truck training. I always said that. I always said that. And I stand by it. So I'm about to talk about it. So if you're interested, when you come out, and you want to get your experience. I'm talking to drivers that wants to get their experience, their first year, second year. And listen, listen, stop listening to people that says after your first year, you're golden. No, you're not. You're not golden after your first year. After your first year trucking, it just open, it just opens up just maybe one or two opportunities. But to get good experience and to show that you have a good uh driver background you want to get at least two to maybe three years of experience that it give you enough time to probably cover the globe enough time to get your back in together enough time to figure out what you want Enough time to figure out but uh, the difference between divisions, okay? Now, listen, for the inexperienced drivers, right, I want you guys to, you know, to listen, okay? And, again, this is just my opinion, but I really feel that Snyder has a good, solid foundation in trucking, especially in their school division, all right? especially in their school division. When you go to their orientation, they will make you one of the best, if not, if not close to it, all right? Maybe best is just overplaying it, but they'll probably make you, give you close to being a good driver as you could possibly can be. The safest driver on the road because Snyder talks safety all the time, okay? They talk safety all the time. And let me let me break it down to you as far as their safety precautions. Couple of drivers that was working, that was driving for the Orange Company has got terminated because of Snyder's safety precautions. So when you go in to go with Snyder, make sure you read that fine print because I'm sure it is in that book. All right. You got to understand Snyder earned their reputation for high quality training and their commitment to safety. That's why I consider them the boot camp of truck training or for orientation. So you, when you get in there, you'll see why. When you find your perfect job. Damn good coffee. And hot. You know. Just use Snyder, okay, so they can train you. Stick it out with Snyder if you can, and they could probably get you on the road, you know, either with them or get you on the road after you get with them. Learn everything you need to learn from them. Take what you learn from them and, and put it to your experience so you can carry that on into your driving career, right? Now, I wonder why I say mess with Snyder, right? Lockout, why, why mess with Snyder? Well, Snyder, you know, for inexperienced drivers, right? I, I, I feel that they are the place that will put you in a position of, of success, right? Inexperienced drivers, depend on what kind of freight you'll be hauling, can vary depending on your needs, all right? But I... I you you want to know, you want to know what to expect from Snyder when you get there as an inexperienced driver, a driver coming out of truck driving school, right? So their van truckload will be three weeks. The intermodal will be three weeks and a half. The tanker will be five weeks, a whole month, and dedicated will be based on the account-specific requirements, right? So you want to know how to prepare 
for orientation when you go over to Snyder, right? Okay, so coming out of coming out of truck driving school doesn't have to be difficult. All you have to do is hop on the phone, grab a recruiter. Damn good coffee. And hot. Hop on the phone and grab a recruiter. Whereas the recruiting team, training team, and the operation team is going to work together to make the process easy for you to transition over to Snyder when you come out of school. All right. It will probably start on a Monday. And of course, when that, whatever division that you take, uh, you'll finish out there. But orientation usually starts on a Monday. You know, you might not have to wait long. So, lockout. Why, why do you consider Snyder the boot camp of truck I mean, of truck driving? Well, because they got they 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 got a lot. They 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 treat it as a whole new school. But lockout, I came out of school. I spent my five thousand plus to do to to get all the information I need to get my CDLs. Why do I need to go back go back to Snyder and go to school through them? Because Snyder will, if not anybody else, will treat you. I mean, teach you the proper way of, of trucking. If I'm not, if, if they'll, they'll treat you the proper way of truck. They got classroom. I mean, they do the classroom, like, like a literal classroom. They give you freaking homework, bro. They give you scenarios like a day in the life of a Snyder driver. Give you that. They said they'll teach you how to use their tablets, how to log in correctly, and how to make the most of a and how to make the most of their benefits. Think about it. Think about it. They'll, they'll check and strengthen the skills you learned in CDL training when you was in school. They'll also introduce a few more practice in the yard or in local yard highways and will make you feel a little bit more comfortable when you burn the wheel. Oh my God. Oh my God, that is the best coffee I've ever tasted. Plus, after you get finished with the orientation, whatever weeks there is for your inexperience, of course, after all of that, you still have to go out with a driver trainer. All right. So they'll put you on the road with, with hopefully a good trainer. You know, hopefully that trainer is experienced in training you and not effing you. We'll talk about that later in another podcast. But they'll put you out there with a trainer. You'll go over the road. You'll make deliveries. You'll fuel. You'll, you'll do everything that's an over-the-road driver does. You, you will become accustomed to the lifestyle. That's why a lot of drivers, including myself, says that trucking is a lifestyle, even though you know, social media trucking has changed the whole, the whole look of what trucking is today. All right. You'll be doing a lot of driver activities. <laughs> You'll learn the day to day of truck driving. You'll be training with the trainer. He'll be in the passenger seat where he's supposed to be to critique and answer all your questions that you have or should be doing. OK. All right. So, again, I think, you know, for inexperienced drivers that's coming out of truck driving school and y'all want to get a good start on uh, on a company and it may not be the best company, you know, that you should start with. But it's a good company that if you want, you know, if you want to be start, if you want to start on the success side of trucking then 
Give Snyder a call, man. Give Snyder a call. All right. If this helps you out in any kind of way, make sure you like, subscribe, and share the channel, the Recruiter Call channel. Yo, let me know what topics you guys like for me to talk about, what companies you like for me to call, or anything of that matter. Send it to me in the comments below. Until next time, this is Lockout Men, and I will come back at you with another one. Peace.